This week we look at three tattoos of unknown date that are thought to have come from the same person. Two of the tattoos depict the well-known religious story of Adam and Eve. Between the naked figures is the serpent of temptation winding itself around the tree of knowledge in the Garden of Eden. In the top tattoo, Adam and Eve are covering their genitals with their hands, perhaps relating to when they became ashamed of their nakedness having eaten fruit from the tree of knowledge. In the bottom tattoo, they have their hands up and are uncovered, representing the time before this event. We are all familiar with the story of Adam and Eve, the first man and woman on earth. The base of this story of their creation is a myth by the Abraham religions. In honor of Christianity and to remember the original sins, people decide to get the Adam and Eve tattoo. This tattoo can be a reminder to live a more honorable life. You can also get it for purely aesthetic purposes. Another reason for getting an Adam and Eve is to remember the essence of brotherhood. There are billions of us on this planet. It's hard to believe we all came from one man and one woman. But we did. Who were they? When and where did they live? Jewish, Christian, and Muslim traditions trace us all back to Adam and Eve. The book of Genesis says they came from a place called Eden, near the Tigris and Euphrates rivers, somewhere in the ancient Near East. No one has yet found the location of the Garden of Eden, though many have tried. But why do we want to find it? Well, the reason is interesting. The Garden of Eden doesn't just represent the beginning of humanity. It is the beginning of our conversation with God. And finding out when and where that took place would tell us an awful lot about who we are. 